In this video, I'm going to explain the basics of creating an ebook with ChatGPT. So, if this is your first time creating an ebook with AI, I'll explain what you need to do and how you can get a functional ebook at the end of it. We're going to use ChatGPT, we're going to use Google Docs, and then we're going to use Canva to actually design the ebook. Now, first, we need a topic to create our ebook around. I'm going to choose one on the best budget travel guide to Thailand. You can create an ebook about anything you want, but choose a subject that you have some interest in or some knowledge in. Now, this video won't cover how to promote the ebook, it will simply show you a step by step way to generate an ebook with AI. So, we're going to chat GPT and then going to type in create a title for my ebook about, and then you would type in your topic. So I've wrote here, create a title for my ebook around budget traveling around Thailand. So we're then going to click enter and we're going to get a title. Now, what I recommend you do with ChatGPT is get many different variations. So I'm going to ask it to give me 10 more. And with ChatGPT, you have to give it the correct prompts to output the content that you're looking for. So now we've got 10 more titles and we can go ahead and choose which one we like. Now, you can be very specific when speaking to ChatGPT. So I could say, make it five words. Okay, so now we've got shorter titles, more specific titles for our ebook. So I'm going to go with ebook name number two. So once you've got your name for your ebook, you can then tell ChatGPT what name you like. Now, after you've done that, it's then going to give you more recommendations once you ask it to write your book. So I'm going to say now, let's generate chapters for the book. So we've got the introduction, we've got planning your trip, we've got packing essentials, affordable accommodation, getting around on a budget, eating, free and low cost attractions, and so on. Now, I think 15 chapters is quite a lot for an ebook. I'd want it to be more concise, maybe around 10. So I've just told ChatGPT to make it more concise. So now with those chapters generated, we can now start writing out our ebook. So I've just said here, give me a 300 word introduction for chapter one. And what's going to happen is it's now going to write us chapter one. So now you've got chapter one wrote. Now I think these paragraphs are a bit too blocky. So I've asked ChatGPT to concise the first paragraph and hook the reader with the intro. All right, so now we have got a better intro. And what we can do is we can copy this new intro into a new blank document on Google Docs. So I'm going to go ahead and grab the name. Our name is Budget Travel Guide to Thailand. We can then go ahead and put that into Google Docs and obviously make that big and as the title. Now we're gonna format this later on, so don't worry too much, but you do want a rough copy here. So when you move to Canva, it is much easier. So I'm gonna copy in this intro and we'll paste it here. And then regarding the other content for the rest of the chapter, I'm gonna copy this here. Now, remember you are gonna to have to read this and maybe make some edits. And you're also going to want to add images to your ebook as well, but you can do that inside of Canva. Now it's essentially now a process of doing this exact same thing for the rest of the chapters. And I'm not going to cover that in this video because it would just be me speaking to chat GPT. But go ahead and generate these chapters here in the same way that I've showed you. You can edit as you go and you can get chat GPT to make changes. Now, once you've got your book somewhat written in Google Docs, you can then go to something like Canva. And with Canva, what you can do once you've created a free account is go to this search bar and type in ebook. Then you can go ahead and go to the suggested templates. And if you're using Canva free, I recommend what you do here is you go ahead and filter for the free ones. So go to all filters and then go ahead and scroll down to the free plans. So here we have some ebooks. We can go ahead and then choose a template. So I'll choose this one, customize this template. And what you can do is you can write your ebook now. So you're gonna have to customize the first page. So I might put here the title, which is budget travel guide to Thailand. Now everything in Canva is fully editable and you're gonna have to figure that out. I've made many videos showing you how to use Canva if you wanna check out my channel for those. You can also replace images and obviously create your ebook cover. Now add a new page and what you can do is you can go to text. You can then go to body text. You can go ahead and paste in your text here into Canva. Now you might not wanna do this all at once. You might want to space it out and you're going to need to change the font, but nonetheless, you paste in your text here and you can obviously resize this to whatever dimensions you want and also edit this and space it out. Now you are gonna need multiple text box, so I would just go ahead and recommend doing one paragraph at a time. Now this might take a while, but it's important to know if you're really trying to create an ebook which you can sell here, it needs to be a good ebook with good information. So go ahead and spend some time formatting your ebook. 
Also, go to the upload section and either search for images or upload your own images. You can also find these in Elements and we can probably grab an image of Thailand here. So there we go. And what you can do now is you can start to build out your ebook based on the writing of ChatGPT. So this does take time. You're not going to be able to whip up an ebook that you can sell within like 10 minutes. You're going to have to put a couple of hours to it. But once you've got your ebook created, you can then potentially sell it. But that's how to do it. Those are the basics. Thank you for watching.